hello people out there it's once more an honor for me to um, show this video it's Lingua Institute and uh, we've realized that we, we see a lot of um, students and partners around the world so we like to make this short video to tell people how is it like to be in Ghana and as you all know Ghana is in the middle of the world that is the, the zero GMT here um, in our country and um, as the center of the world there are a lot of interesting things you would see um, a lot of interesting places you can visit and when it comes to the Ghanaian dishes I tell you it's one of the best and um, most of our meals are, I would say starchy food No, but Ghanaians love varieties, they like to experiment, they like to um, taste something different from a different part of um, the, 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 the world. So there are restaurants, there are fast food joints where you can get any meal that you need. Um, Chinese fast food, they have the French cuisine, um, anything that you like to eat and um, gladly and um, by chance, Lingua Institute is found at um, a place where um, you can get every single meal from every single place you live. Um, because we are dedicated to serving um, clients, we make sure that they get what they need and we help them get the best. The Ghanaian weather is practically two seasons, the, the, the dry season and the wet season. So when you come to Ghana, you are likely to meet the rain or the sun. But when the sun comes, it's really hot. When it rains, sometimes it can get dangerous. Um, getting um, casual wear in the course of the day, it's, it's better. But um, when it's cold, I advise um, you come along with some, some coats that will help you out. We, we have some interesting places like the Kakum National Park in the central region of Ghana. We have the Ebri Falls, um, Ebri Garden, sorry. Oh my god. We have um, some other botanical gardens. Uh, we have um, the Akusumbu um, Dam. Um, we have the Mami uh, Kuma Mesoleum. We have the castle built by the Portuguese. Um, centuries ago which would be lovely for people to visit we have also the Nina castle which uh, was visited quite um, recently by the, pres the former president of America Obama and um, just around um, Lingua Institute lies a very small natural um, I would say lake uh, which you can find some crocodiles in it <laughs> Not the bigger ones, <laughs> but it's love, it's fun um, to be to be in Ghana. Sincerely, I've been to a lot of countries um, around uh, Africa, and um, I've realized that uh, Ghana it's it's a place to be called home. When it comes to security, um, Ghana can boast to be number one in Africa um, because this is just some countries, and I realize how insecure someone might be but when I come to them I feel very very secure not because I'm a Ghanaian but because I know the difference uh, uh, differences in this is not, uh, uh, African countries and uh, people here are so lovely they are hospitable they, they, they like to, to accept um, the differences of people and help them wherever the case might be so I welcome you all to Ghana and um, you can see our contact WhatsApp contact, you can get in touch with us or you can email us info at lingoinstitute.com for any um, question or any um, preoccupation. Thank you for the time and courage that you